told you it was about the situation where yeah the battery where, where the battery and the battery and, yeah the battery cable was uh, loose and you put it together so now let's go ahead and run a complete diagnosis I mean, no, the, the, the information that I see here, yeah. just ask question to make it easy for me and you while we work on it. Okay. Sometimes you park the car, you go, somebody want to back up in front of you and he come, you do like this on the it, bumper. Want to cause off? Yeah, and you don't know. Yeah. And then in the, in this collision yeah. sign comes up? It, it will come if because in the front there by the bumpers, some cars they have a, a camera there, a radar there. Everything good, right? Everything. Often, when you park, some people don't even know when to stop backing up until they hit the car. Uh -huh, uh -huh. I mean, you, you got a bunch of people that have that. That's why you get nicks and, and scratches everywhere yeah. on your damn car. Especially in New, especially New York. <laughs> yes, especially yeah. New York. Some yeah. don't know no part, to yeah. stop backing up until they hit the damn car behind them or in front of them. Yes, it's true. They scratch up their own car, they scratch up your car. Yes, and I'm did. like. So these signs can come up if my car is if, parked. If, if the car have a, like a radar yeah. in the front of the grill yeah. and somebody touch it, it will go like this or it will go like this mm -hmm. and it, it, will, it, will, it will create a code. But sometimes only a check in your light mm -hmm. will create a code. Say, look, we are not okay, so please disable it. Right, so, so because now we have a check engine light here, let's, yeah. let's look at this one here and then we see what yeah, happens. Yeah, I, I, I want to start, because like, you know what? The same day that this thing happened with the battery, mm -hmm. I was running my air conditioner. Mm -hmm. Ever since then, I didn't run my air conditioner ever since. Okay. I want to run my air conditioner again. Yeah, if, if everything is okay, it's supposed to work. Okay. Mm -hmm. We're going to see if it is. Good. Let me see why I'm not getting the VCI. VCI is good. Connecting it to the car. Right Say it again. Yeah, it's checking it out right now. Okay, hold on. Yeah, I'm trying to check it out. Though. No, we were mentioning about we were talking about collision. It's just that somebody could have hit the car while it was parked. Yeah. That's why it has this collision sign. You know that? You know the lights that you keep complaining about that's on all the time. Yes. And you just you just you just explain to me that has to do something to do with a collision. It's a new car, 2020. Okay. Yeah, I'm 
Yeah. Anything with red, that's there is a fault. You see, like all this fault. Mm -hmm. You see, anything with a green, no fault. So, every air conditioning two fault. You know, like some computers they have like five faults, six fault. Eyesight fault. Um, so. Yeah, I see. They say eyesight fault, but I'm gonna see here. It's a information three fault. If the battery went dead, like disconnect of the battery, it could create like chaos in electronics. Okay. But we just have to see what we have here. Power window is good. Okay, now you see right here. This is let's start from its engine coolant bypass valve range. Engine coolant bypass. Engine is tall. Is a history. Battery booster signal too. That what what you talk about is true. Mm -hmm. uh, intermediate shaft speed sensor B. All these are history, but the shaft speed sensor we don't like this. It's a P2747. Mm -hmm. Thus we don't like it. Now the brake history. Anything history is okay. Yaw rate sensor, automatic vehicle hold switch, loss communication with the steering angle sensor, loss communication with the eyesight. And now passenger airbag on off history. Uh, warning box communication fault. All these are history. Tire pressure. Tire pressure monitor. Left front, right front. All these are history. Which is anything history is good. Transponder communication history. Sonar. Sun load sensor. Is current but is okay. Loss communication with the body history. A lot of them are history. Okay, TCM abnormal, transmission abnormal, ECM abnormal, VDC history, history, Bluetooth history, driver side power windows history. Green is good. I don't have anything else I can tell you, but those are okay now. So anything history, we consider it just in the memory, is a shadow. Like something happened mm -hmm. and is a history. We not consider it serious unless it repeat itself again okay. so here p1603 it just say engine is stalled like like you say my car is stalled shut off okay. and battery booster signal maybe the battery was disconnected that maybe is causing it mm -hmm. and also immediate shaft is peace sensor intermediate shaft is peace sensor this is also history but okay. this one we consider it we're going to keep this one in memory the 2747 engine coolant bypass is now P26 A37 is available. They call it engine coolant bypass valve range. This is related to maybe the when you when the first start of the car to warm up, there is like a thermostat or yeah. or anything like that. But we don't consider it as serious now. So what we're gonna do is and also the brakes communication with the vehicle, brake, all these are history. So I'm going to go to do a com complete reset for all these codes and see what's going to happen. One code and the engine is still there. Where, where, okay, engine coolant bypass. Okay, you see everything is green, that means they say okay. okay. The eyesight also still you have a problem on it. <sighs> yes, eyesight. Now you see we have two two coats, they never go away. Yeah, the eyesight and the engine coolant, the engine cool, engine coolant bypass valve. Those two, we have them and they never go away. Even though you see the um, okay. the light go away. Alright. I'm gonna try to reset it again. There's two. Let me take a picture. Take take a picture of this if you, just to keep it in case.
check the engine light just came back on. No, the car is not. Okay. Mama, good morning. Good morning. What's going hey, on? Hey, good. How is it? Just leave him alone. Early morning. I'm coming. Right, I'm coming right. to talk to you. Just let me see. But I need the spot. I okay. have cars I gotta take out of the driveway. Just tell him that you need to take some cars. I'm coming. I explained it then, but he says he's waiting for you. Okay. This this one here. Okay. Hello. I just sent you some photos of what okay. the dog knocks a bit. The, the lights now are now off and reset it. So. <laughs> Yeah, the eye side and the checking the light coming together. So we have here uh, when on the engine side, you know, like the check engine light and the eye side. The eye side have no problem. This cruise control issue here, this one here, mm -hmm. it have no problem at all. But he is seeing that he is looking at the engine control module. Yeah. That the check engine light come on right away. He come on. Right. Look here. What he say is the eyesight control module. He say is I'm not. He have no problem. But he say look, the engine computer have a problem. That means the engine computer have a coolant bypass valve range performance. That's why when it's just like somebody who have a high blood pressure and he have headache. Yeah. That means the headache is caused by the high blood pressure. Correct. So this one here, the 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 cruise control system and the crash doesn't have no problem at all. But he is looking at the car, he say, look, I am seeing a check engine light on. And that check engine light on causing me to stop. Oh. So this one here, uh, uh, disregard it. We have no problem with it. This but this I one here, we, we, yeah, we, have, yeah, we have this problem now. Hmm? Now we have this problem here. So yeah. we, we reset it and it come back again. Yeah. So now we have a problem with this, with this sensor with this issue here we have okay. to go and create a test plan and a repair plan now now we know what's wrong okay now it is about your schedule and how it is if we are going to take this car and spend some time on it the diagnosis result come with this one we reset it two times it come back that yeah. means there is a problem related to this sensor yeah. so our job is you don't have this before you don't have this. No, I never had this yeah. before. So we have a it's problem. The first time it's popped up. So no problem. So we yeah, are going yeah. to create yeah. a plan to see what that means, what we need to do, and who causing this one. We already have the code. Mm -hmm. So we have to track the code now. You see, everything here is gone. We have before like 20 codes. Now we left only with two codes. Then the, the, the root cause of all this light coming up and down and all this light is because of the P26 Apple 3. Mm 